Hello, and welcome back to the Milk Bar podcast, where we talk about comedic commentary, pop culture from the week prior, which will be like recent news, games, food, and more. Today, we are joined by Simon, Ellis, myself, Chris, we've got Oshan, and Steve. Why did you want to say my name? Oshan. Oshan. Just makes it up, you know. How what, is man, everybody? The incorrect way to <laughs> say that. Sounds like name. a fucking Swedish chef. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Sorry. And, I'm spice it up a little bit. And oh. Angus Franklin over here. Um, and Gly Frank. The most. Oh, shut up. <laughs> Waffling, mate. Um, is everyone all right? No. All right. Cool. I'm all right. Yeah. Oh, okay. Look, most of us were actually wearing the merch today. Oh, yes. Yeah, buddy. Yeah, mine smiles. Yeah, I knew that before. <laughs> Me. <laughs> okay. Um, okay. Cool. Nice. Well, I'm glad you're all right. Um, so, everybody, make sure you subscribe to the Patreon. Uh, so, so, you know, I feel like people are forgetting. I mean, we've got a hat that's just sat here for ages. Yeah, yeah, that's the reason. Yeah, I know. Everyone just keeps yeah. forgetting to subscribe yeah. to the it's Patreon. Weird. I swear that's, yeah. the, <laughs> that's the reason. Yeah. So I just thought I'd remind you, you know, we've yeah. got one. Um, and in case you're wondering what, what what you can get, so three quid a month, mate. Uh, you know, the price of a nice coffee. Uh, you could get a great deal from us. Less than, the, less than a coffee. Coffee nowadays is like six quid. Bargain, mate. That's like two coffees, mate. I mean, no. two. <laughs> <laughs> that's half. You don't need to half subscribe twice. <laughs> that's two. Half a coffee. You can yeah. get what? You can get merch discounts, podcast specials, um, and you know you're helping us to produce these videos for you. So you know, and you can maybe check. maybe that's the reason no one subscribed. Yeah, they're, they're gone, just buying coffee. Fucking, I'm not paying for that shit. <laughs> oh, maybe they. Just and yet you're all watching. All seven of you. <laughs> now nah, there's at least eight. <laughs> eight. Damn, we're doing all right this week. Mm. Um, yeah, maybe maybe they just think we don't need it. Mate, they look at us like professional. Fucking <laughs> <don't need> <laughs> oh, hell! That. Look at the quality yeah, of this. Yeah, they don't need it. Um, we do. Okay, yeah. So if you do, uh, Patreon.com/slash Milton. Nice. Check it out. Okay. Segment one. Oh fuck. Oh no. Oh, no. None of us thought. Why didn't we do this? We always get to this stage. I know, yeah. We always. Hang we on, always, wait. Yeah. They don't know what we're on about. Story of the week. <laughs> no. no, I don't think anyone's got a story. Um, um, give me a minute. So, you know. Do you know what? Simon, Simon, just say something. Say five <laughs> stories for every one of us. <laughs> and we'll pick the best one. I've got a cool story. So, one day, right, we were um, getting like the roof cleaned on the house and stuff. And. Um, my dad was cleaning the gutters out, right? And cut his hand on the... Well, he cut his hand and it was bleeding. He was like, what, what's just happened there? <laughs> Why has this happened? And he was rummaging around and he found um, an eight-inch uh, kitchen knife hidden in... <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> drain pipe. Because it was above my brother's room, my oldest brother, and he'd hid it there in case someone ever attacked him outside his window. <laughs> what? <laughs> and so... We got in touch with my brother, obviously, and he, he reckons around, like, the house and the street area is hidden <laughs> just countless different weapons. <laughs> <laughs> like machetes, everything, and he's just Jeez. hidden them all. This That's... is like Dwight in real life. <laughs> it's not a good thing. No, it's not. <laughs> it's well, like... no, it is. Not in the street. He's always prepared. Yeah, but in the street. <laughs> like what if something goes down it? in the street? <laughs> really hidden, though, Stephen. And there's no kids out anymore because they're all inside playing. Because they'll touch the weapons and die. <laughs> <laughs> was your dad all right? Yeah, he was okay. Like he just um, he was a bit pissed off. But it's, it's just fair. like he was just paranoid when he was younger. So he's that's what he did. He just did. No one notice a missing kitchen knife. No, it wasn't ours. We didn't. We didn't know where he got it. From. <laughs> like, it was just a knife. That's even better. Like, we just didn't know where it came from. Oh. <laughs> Right. There's a little yeah. random story. Yeah. Yeah. That, is random. that is random. I like it though. <laughs> what if it's still happening though and he's still hiding shit? He might be, you know. Mm. He goes to his house. The <laughs> <laughs> booby trap there. <laughs> it's like the curtain reels of spear, like stuff. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh. Um, no. That's 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 a good one. <laughs> no, it's that's not. You're gonna put in yours now. Yeah. In my house. 
Wait, don't on. know if I mentioned it. Oh, for God's uh, sake. <laughs> got to get that in there. Yeah, every single <laughs> podcast. from. Like, I have a house. Have you got a story for Ellis? <laughs> I'm not just going to put out five stories. You've got to tell a story do a about story, but me. Bit, everyone needs to that <laughs> that, story. That'll be interesting. <laughs> Instead You've, of you. Tell a story about me that you might remember about me. What's like the first, how, how did you meet? That's boring. Okay. That boring. Yeah, that is I fucking must, really boring. <laughs> That's how you met. Yeah, I just kissed him in the It street. was a date. <laughs> a story for everyone. I've got a story about how me and Stephen first kind of met. You've, You've known each other since like, the conception Toddlers. of the universe. <laughs> We're not that fucking old. Were you there? Yeah, I remember. <laughs> he, he was the one that fucking made it. The old <laughs> um, No, I mean, I knew of you, but the first time I sort of interacted with you, because you were friends with someone that we're all friends with, called Robbie. Questionable. Gross. <laughs> well, are we? No. Um, but you, were, you and him were like best mates at the time. Yeah. And yeah. I, at the time, lived around the corner from Robbie. I think I might have told this story. Anyway, we'll yeah, get. We'll yeah, just, I think you have because yeah. I've heard it about four hundred million times. I don't remember <laughs> it at all. We'll just fucking say it anyway. Why not? I don't remember. It. It's probably because you're never fucking here, mate. <laughs> oh yeah. Um, no. So I was I was outside playing on my skateboard, and then Robbie and Stephen were walking home to get to Robbie's house, and then um, Robbie was like, "Oh, what are you doing? What are you practicing?" And I was like, "Ollies or whatever," and then they walked off. That's it. That's the <laughs> and that's it. Story. That's the story. Oh no, sorry. And then um, Robbie was like, "Oh yeah, I'm trying. I'm trying to do that as well." And then Stephen went, "You can't skateboard." And I went, "Yeah, he can. He's actually really good." I was just like sticking up for Robbie. And then, <laughs> like a week later, I went to Robbie's house and I was like um, talking about Stephen to Robbie. And then Robbie was like, "Yeah, Stephen doesn't like you like, at all. <laughs> he really doesn't like you." Like when you said that the other day, he came over to mine and he was like chatting absolute shit about you. It's like, huh? It does sound like Stephen to me. It, it does sound like him, doesn't it? So it is so true. He's always been a bell end. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Do you like me now? <laughs> You've got to answer. You're not going to like the answer. <laughs> <laughs> That's just Simon story. <laughs> All right. Just put my back to him. At least I can skateboard, Steve. Well, can you? Can, can you? you? <laughs> not anymore. <laughs> Better than him, though. You break the board, lad. Whoa. <laughs> Where the fuck would that come from? Get you back to him. Yeah, what the fuck? <laughs> Hang on a minute, Steve. I'm more, I'm more friends with you at the moment. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking calling me a fat cunt. I know I am, but like, there's no need to point it out. Do you know what I mean? <laughs> Bastard. <laughs> Why has this turned into like a bullion sesh? Roast. The roast of Ashan. No. Let's not do that. He likes a roast, doesn't he? On Sunday. <laughs> <laughs> What is, what is happening? <laughs> this is story of the week, not let's fucking bully the shit. Let's bully Oshin until he kills himself. <laughs> You've got a fucking set of balls on you to chat shit to me. Matter of fucking crap. I, oh, do you know what? I'm not even going go there. Mate. Got the power. Got yeah, the power. host with the most fucking... Should we just say Simon's dad wins? <laughs> that? Oh, yeah. We didn't really win. <laughs> no, we cut his hand. Yeah. Darn Let, oh, blast, blast. I've got an idea. Let's tell a story about all our dads. Mine, uh, yeah. mine left. Doesn't he live in Spain or something? I don't know. My mum said he left. So I didn't actually know this until um, quite recently, but my mum and him were actually engaged. Then my mum got pregnant with me by accident. And um, We're all accidents, mate. Don't worry about it. Yeah, you definitely was. were. Fucking prick. And... Um, not you, Si. Um, you also were, though. I was, yeah. No, so, as I was saying before, I was rudely interrupted by a cunt. Um, what was I saying? I've lost my train <laughs> of thought. They were engaged. Oh, yeah, they were engaged, yeah. So then I got, she got pregnant with me and then had me, and then my dad, he was like a bit of a party animal, just wanted to just go out and party, whatever. Didn't want me there, so then he left, yeah. called off the engagement, and I think he moved somewhere abroad. Then he remarried, had a few more kids, waited 10 years, then left them. <laughs> and that's... What a lad. Yeah. At least, at, least yeah. He, at least he tried the second time. Mm. You know what I mean? Yeah, maybe the next time you'll last a little bit longer, like 15 years or something. Yeah, yeah could do. Maybe. Mm. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do the exact same. You're following his footsteps, haven't you, really? 
We can't, it doesn't know where he went. <laughs> I've already made that joke on this podcast. <laughs> Don't lie. I have. I no swear. fucking here, mate. Yeah, well, <laughs> fair point. Uh, nice. You should go on one of those hereditary um, TV shows where you find the lost siblings and whatever, but change it up by actually finding him and then just beating the shit out of him. The kids? No, not the kid. Your dad. Oh, you, well, you said he said siblings, and then he said beat the shit out of them. Well, they usually just find siblings because the parents are usually fucking dead. Well, I don't think he's dead. So go find him and kill him. How would you know? End the cycle. New Milkman video. <laughs> <laughs> Hunting father. End the cycle. Yeah. End the Bennett yeah. line. <laughs> what? I'm not going to kill myself. <laughs> That's the end of the video. Your bloodline starts with you. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? Yeah. What about your dad, Chris? Um, my dad stuck around. Um, no school. need. Yeah. I mean, I don't know why he would do, but he did. Yeah, with you. Fucking yeah. hell. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm one of five, so chances are I'm an accident. Who would want five? Do you know what I mean? Anyway, so, I mean, fucking horny job. bastards, do you know what I mean? Getting oh, busy. Wow. Hang on. <laughs> yeah, You've just called your mum and dad horny bastards. <laughs> I mean, dodgy. Right. <laughs> Can we just make that a thing? <laughs> I mean, why would you have five kids? Anyway, so no, that is a good point to be fair because I only want like two, three. I'm, I'm most. one of five, and only one of my brothers was planned. <laughs> Guess which one? Danny. Danny. Well, so didn't go to plan, did it? Are you sure it's not a mistake? Is he the favourite? Yeah, of course he's the favourite. I don't is like he? him. Do you know what he got for his birthday? Presents. A lot. Really? What did he yeah. get? I can't remember. It was a long You're time ago. You're talking about a recent <laughs> Long time ago. <laughs> it was nearly a year ago. Birthday's in December. Oh, shit. Yeah, it is. <laughs> Fuck. Fuck's sake. Have, have you brought up another know? birthday? Yeah, fucking Do you know what I got hell. for my birthday? Kinder boy. Bueno. Nothing. I got my little brother Andy to remind my dad that it was my birthday so he could say, have birthday to me. <laughs> and then he gave me 50 quid. When's your birthday? July. <laughs> That's so shocking that you just said that. I don't know anyone's fucking birthday. I'm surprised I remembered Chris's, to be honest. Of course you remember Chris's, though. September... <laughs> 11th. Hang on. <laughs> he wishes. Yeah. Uh, there's a six in it, isn't there? It is. Is it 26th? It is. Yeah, yeah. it's only because... That's only because it's recently gone mm. by. Yeah. And you still struggle. Mm. <laughs> it's been a while. Speaking of which, with birthdays and that, fuck this story bullshit. I won. I've actually, yeah, I've actually got some presents for you all because I recently went on holiday. Oh shit! Yeah. No, no. So there's a right. few in here. They're all the same sort of gift. Is, oh, is, are we doing like a grab bag? Yeah. Exactly. It's just full of knives, <laughs> used needles. Um, so. They're all, this, they're all the same item, but they're all different shapes and sizes. So, Stephen. Oh, I get to go first? Yep. <laughs> Whoa! What are you doing? <laughs> 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 is he <it> alive? <laughs> <laughs> Why is it slimy? <laughs> oh. What is it? <laughs> are they all the same thing? <laughs> yeah. Oh, you know what? I'm not going to show it. We di no, show it because I'll just blur it out. No, it's just for them okay. though, because they, they had the reveal of the bag. Yeah. Okay, oh, right. Yeah. So we'll all do it at the same time, okay? We've all got a reveal at the same time. So, Chris, you're next. Oh, right. Don't look in the bag! Don't hide it because I don't want to do Ellis. Let's I do it first. Why is it why is it sticky? I don't know. <laughs> Look at it. Is it? Okay. I'm not sure if I've got <laughs> okay. not sure if I've got two or one. I've got one. Yeah. I have actually got some spares here just in case. <laughs> in case you threw them or something. Yeah. Oh hell yeah. Oh that I see. They right. Everyone show them to the cameras so, so that we can blur them out. So they are different. Nice. Hey. Oh wait, Chris. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking hell, what? <laughs> Chris got the safest one. Yeah, Chris yeah. got a pretty... Yeah, mine's quite same one. Oh, no. My Same one's man. very broke. Let's see. Do you want a new one? <laughs> Let the magnets fall it off and... <laughs> oh, uh, yeah, I've got a spare. Pick a new one. Okay. You can actually just have a look at the new ones. Get them all out, see what... Yeah. Yeah. Just describe them to the audience. Okay. Well, 
It's a this penis. <laughs> oh, this, oh, this is cute. I want this that says, one. This says for my best friend. Mine says it's for cute. my best friend as it's well. It better not be one of these. Oh. We'll be best friends. It says for my best friend, and it's the body of a naked woman. I like that. Nice. Pretty cool. Oh, now this has got the uh, the, uh, the other one. I've got the one that's just a hung <laughs> from my best friend. Oh, wait a minute. That one's real. What? Whoa. This one's a little more PG. <laughs> and Those, they, they, she got the heavies. Yeah. Let me tell you. <laughs> There's some milkers. You right can there. show that to the camera. That is pretty. Look at that. Nice. <laughs> anyway. We definitely can't show Stevens or oh, Ellis's. Or the, or the broken. Mine's all right. It's just, a, it's a guy, but he's. He's just, you know, he's just a little rummage, isn't he? He's having a little yeah, rummage. Fumble. It's got yeah. Tenerife it's got as a itch. tattoo. Yeah. <laughs> Let's put these back in the bag. Yeah. Anyway, happy birthday, lads, because that's you. all I'm getting <laughs> for you. <laughs> like for next year. Like, is for the, it, for is the, the July. Fall. Yeah, that's your present. That's for my birthday. When is? When is? When <laughs> is? <laughs> when is, <laughs> Christian? <Mo? laughs> June? <laughs> Ju this gone off June 12th. Is it? Yes. Nice. Good job. I, that. I only remember that because we went on holiday at the time near his birthday. That's the only reason. And it's one day after my birthday, but in a different month. So it's quite a few days after my birthday. <laughs> Two months after your birthday. <laughs> yeah, sure. 32 days after your birthday. 60. 62. Did you say two months or one month? He said one month. One. Two. Sorry. Oh, I don't care. Right? <laughs> Happy birthday. Nice. Jesus. Shall we move on? Yeah. I, I, I got a present for you. No, oh, oh, he's, yeah, he's got a present. <laughs> so I ordered a present for you. Bit it didn't come until right. the night that we all went out. But we'd already gone out then, and I couldn't get it. <laughs> so it was when we got back, it was there. Oh my god, that's why you wanted to go back to yours, isn't it? I forgot, and then Simon was like, "No, I'm tired." <laughs> that's not happened. <laughs> yes, it is. But obviously, keeping up with tradition, <laughs> get you a t-shirt. <laughs> but uh, uh, well, I'm ready for the reveal here. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, that was a great that. one. That Show the cameras. I actually think you will wear <laughs> that. That's amazing. There's a new sheriff in town. Right. And obviously, I've got a cowboy frog tattoo, yeah. haven't I? It, well, I think that's probably the reason <laughs> you got you that one. Yeah, no. Dick. I'm just showing to the viewers in case they forget, yeah. you know. Oh, thank you, Stephen. It's all right. I was like, I, you know, usually you just get t shirts, but then like some of them are just bad. So like, this one I'll definitely isn't for the draw. Yeah, I know. I, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this one. Best joke this I've ever made. <laughs> thank you, Stephen. That's very right. nice of you. Show the camera properly, just in case they couldn't see it. There you go. There's a new sheriff in town. <laughs> nice. Nice little frog. Mm. Yes. Frog with a cowboy hat. Got a good smile. <laughs> All right, shag it then. Ooh. Only if he wears it. What? Yeah. <laughs> it's another present for you. Should we move on? Yeah. How come he got two presents? Why? Well, fuck, I can't complain. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Where's my person, <laughs> Simon? Jeez. Let's carry on. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, if you want to be a Milkman founder, check out milkmen.shop. Uh, so we have limited edition hoodies, t-shirt, caps, and more. Milkman Original will keep you cuddly, warm, and cozy. With free shipping on orders over £69 across the UK, purchase any product, and you'll be labelled as a Milkman founder. Also, you know, because we've done, like, the milk, the new Milkman Original t-shirt jumper, whatever, in, the, in our colours, orange, pink, purple, blue, blue, and green. Shall we do a bit of a bet? So whichever colour sells the most... Wait. Whichever, co whichever colour sells the least, they have to forfeit something. Like, they have to do something. Well, it's either going to be Danny or Simon. Nah. Sell the least? Yeah. I don't see many people... People like orange. Wear... People like pink. No, they don't. I don't see that many people wear orange ever. I'm going to lose. I'm going to buy one. Just... What, what, what was the forfeit? I don't know. He says it because it's blue. I mean, he said yeah, it. I know, it's yeah, I know. It's like the best colour. We've already had one sale of the blue, so I'm winning currently. Thanks, Jackstar. Hell Cheers, mate. Up. I miss him. Nice. No, so you Is can... he dead? No, 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 no. <laughs> yeah. I just don't work with him anymore. Oh, do you know what? Actually, quite funny. When I, del when I sent the package out to him for his order, yeah. you know when you get um, a package and then the person goes, oh, let me just take a photo. There's a photo of Jack Star and his toes <laughs> just yeah. in the photo. I need this photo. <laughs> yeah, I'll, I'll post it everywhere. <laughs> so anyway, what's this forfeit? What should we do? Whichever colour sells the least. Uh, I'm not pitching in because my purple's on the table. <laughs> huh? Purple's on the table for losing, so I'm not saying a forfeit. <laughs> no, it isn't. 
Who? How do you know? Purple might win. Drink a vial of piss. Mm. What the I can't fuck? Drink two vials of piss in one day. <laughs> Who said it was today? Oh, you're just gonna do it on <laughs> You'll the do day. It already. Oh, yeah, I do. I do yeah. one a day anyway. <laughs> <laughs> two in a day is too much. What are you doing? He knows his limits. <laughs> he knows his limits. That's fair. Um, what about it? You have to wear the merch. Oh, oh God. Oh. God. No, you well, let's find out. Let's find. <laughs> let's find a really fucked t-shirt and make them wear it for a day. Yeah, one with a frock now. <laughs> <laughs> one of them like don't bully me, I'll come on. Like you've got. I've literally got one you, of those. You literally just wear that. Anyway, <laughs> yeah, I just so wear that. Full, no, so. something really offensive. Oh, yeah, like something really fucking racist. Well, maybe hey. not racist. Maybe like 9/11. Just like Oh, cuz that's, that's worse. Right. No, it's not. No. It's <laughs> that's the it. point. <laughs> Oh yeah. <laughs> right. Okay. Well, we'll, we'll, you know, we'll think of something. I support the gays. What? <laughs> Say something positive. <laughs> what are you fucking waffling on about? So it's about, just like a really nice message. About that about news it. segment. Yeah. All right. <laughs> it was him. It was him bringing it up with the old forfeit thing. Anyway, so check out the merch on Men Shop. That's yeah. Basically, what I was going to say. Stephen, you're right. We're on to the news segment, everybody. So <laughs> I've just read a bit. <laughs> you wrote it. I know, I forgot. <laughs> Fuck's sake. You ready for this? So, mm. a box of giraffe poo was seized at airport after a woman wanted to use it to make a necklace. US Customs and Border Protection said a person could have contracted a disease from the unusual jewelry and developed serious health issues. Bremen had declared the small box of poo when she was selected to have her <laughs> organs inspected upon arrival at Minneapolis St. Paul Airport in Minnesota. That's when that's September. US Customs and Border Patrol has said the woman from Iowa said she has previously made a necklace with moose feces. Okay, what? okay. Why did she Slow. declare it? <laughs> Slow news week, yeah. <laughs> so, yeah, there's no, really, there's no real question. That's just. Of course, why are there real question? Iowa? There's news. What? Just more, yeah. The fuck. Would you do? How, what would it even <laughs> look like if it was yeah. a necklace? Just, just shit. roll it into balls. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, like, like a, a pearl, uh, necklace. pearl necklace. Yeah, pearl necklace, but made out of mm. poo. Shit. A pearl yeah. necklace. You nice. idiots. <laughs> Bomb brain cell. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Probably right. There is that site, though, that you can send people um, animal poo, isn't there? Mm. What? So <laughs> you pay a fee, right? Depends on how much shit you want to send to me. <laughs> and then... <laughs> You could send like gorilla shit, like elephant shit to people, to people's houses. Like, Why didn't she just do that? Yeah, she, could have, she didn't even have to make the trip. Mm. But Cheaper like, to like, get it from the source. Hold it a basket. And... <laughs> really? Yeah, there's literally a, a site you can. I haven't told them that. I know exactly what I'm getting Danny for his birthday. <laughs> Don't what? send shit to my house. <laughs> <laughs> it's just my own shit. <laughs> yes, I didn't know. It's my shit in the box. <laughs> no. But like, imagine sending someone just like 10 kilos of elephant shit. <laughs> and what do you even I do? really want to do it. <laughs> what like is, a, let me like find this site. There's like a truck yeah. backing into the, yeah, into like the like driveway. Yeah, you can, you can, yeah. Probably no limit. Send shit. Two trucks. I mean, Two they've got to get the shit from somewhere. There's got to be a limit. <laughs> no way, it's just called. <laughs> send shit.co.uk. Just like feed an elephant a load of laxatives. Oh my God, you can send cow oh. shit. Jesus. So yeah. 1999. For how much capacity? <laughs> how much shit? <laughs> how much shit? Uh, I don't know. It doesn't say. Just Select the wrapping. <laughs> Halloween, Christmas, Valentine's. Birthday? <laughs> yeah. Valentine's. Oh, because, because we know Danny's not going to be watching this, can we do this right here, right now? <laughs> I'm not sure if I want to spend 20 quid on Danny. We'll split it. You'd spend 20 quid on the ship, but not on Danny. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. That's fair. That is fair. I'll just send it to myself. <laughs> 1999. What else can you get? So you can get top offers <laughs> domestic pig, horse, donkey. How does it work? Let's have a look. <laughs> do we really need to do this now? I know, yeah. <laughs> just like pause the whole podcast because he wants to look. How can I send shit to someone? <laughs> Oh, no way. The shipping is completely free of charge. That's, that's, cool. that's decent for shit, isn't it? <laughs> <laughs> Sendshit.co.uk. Have a look. 
Anyway, what were we saying? Uh, oh, the giraffe. Giraffe shit. She, she made it. To... I'm just trying to picture what it would look like. It's going to be sh- well, It's, it's going to be shit. <laughs> 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 she pushed like, little jewels into it and that. Yeah. Ooh. Sweet corn. You can't polish a turd, but you can... No, it's just a pendant, massive lump of shit. <laughs> with a picture of a giraffe on it. Just crudely drawn in with like a... <laughs> she doesn't even try. Yeah. It's like, doesn't even look like a giraffe. Doesn't even look like a necklace. It just looks like shit. It's not even like pushed together with string. It's just like... They've stretched it out. <laughs> <laughs> Rolled it into a hot like a sausage. <laughs> anyway, shall we move on to the next? Yes. Okay, so another bit of news. Uh, an expert has offered insight into why so many men according to a highly popular TikTok trend, obsessed with the Roman Empire. The hashtag Roman Empire has been viewed well over a billion times on TikTok, the most aimed at asking men the question, how often do you think about the Roman Empire? The uh, general consensus for gentlemen, both young and old, seems to be an awfully lot. So, do you think of the Roman Empire? I'm not going to answer this first, because... I will. Go on. I don't think I've ever thought of the Roman Empire, apart from school. Yeah. I'm I saying, generally have never thought of it. I don't know where this has come from. I think it's just a meme. Yeah, but is it? I think because people... today. Okay. <laughs> think of all they gave us, you know? Roads. Mm. Drainage systems. Mm. All right, fucking mm. hell. Don't get turned on, Do you know mate. What I mean? Yeah, I could have done that. <laughs> Fuck off. No, you couldn't. <laughs> a hole in the ground, yeah. You can't even get a caravan out of a field. <laughs> 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 that's fair nice Chris do you yeah I wouldn't say it's like every day every but day but every I'd so say often. yeah me me a couple of times a month you know why did the Roman Empire fall like it seemed like it was such a massive thing then all of a sudden it wasn't it's killing I mean, Jesus wasn't it the Trojan shut horse up. or was that just something else that's just a story no that's a no I, boring just shut up Steve that is, that's because I that's why I, I think quite a bit of the Trojan horse because I always think about like that's funny it's a saying but, yeah, but I just think that they must have had some right banter in there. Do you know what I mean? When they got pushed in. Do you yeah. Know what I mean? like, look at these these dickheads. <laughs> look at this horse's ass. <laughs> what? What? <laughs> what the fuck are you on about? I'm going to um, Google it. That is mad, though, isn't it? That that actually happened. Like a big fucking wooden horse. <laughs> Did it actually, was it actually like a historical? Yeah. Did it happen? It yeah, it's historic. like Jesus. <laughs> yeah. Fair enough. If it was written down, it's true. Yeah, yeah. That's so, why they fell. They killed him. Damn. What? The Romans. Why they killed I, why Jesus. Six G. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, what? <laughs> I swear, there's a six next to it. Fair anyway, six Gs. And um, yeah, so I mean, I don't think of Roman Empire all the time, but I mean, it, it just like it happened. Is I think about all sorts of random shit. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It's not just like specifically, I'm like, Chris, right, then speak. <laughs> What's he going to say? He's going to have a fucking stroke. What's going on? I know why it fell. Okay, go on. Just mainly because of corruption and division within their government, but also because they went to Germany and just got fucked up. Oh. Ah. There's, there's a whole division of like Roman soldiers. It's something like 5,000 soldiers that went into the Black Forest in Germany and disappeared. And like, still to this day, no one knows, where they, knows where they went. So we can thank Hitler for stopping the Romans. I don't think. I don't. I don't <laughs> quite. Far let's, no, let's not thank no. Hitler for anything. <laughs> thank you, Hitler, <laughs> for saving us from the Romans and global reach. <laughs> what a Hitler talk from you recently, Alice. And they gave us some extra months as well. Oh, huh? Yeah, like Julius Gen- Caesar, mm, July, August, August, Augustus, Gloop. <laughs> <laughs> Shut the fuck up. <laughs> Thanks, Dahl. Okay, Thank you, August Hitler. So many people. Fucking hell. They literally, yeah, they gave us like months. That was a bit weird. <laughs> yeah. It kind of ruined things, actually. Yeah, think about fucking it. wankers. There was a system. <laughs> I'm never thinking about them again. <laughs> Who decided a weekend is two days? Then. Yeah. Uh, the it, was, it was, was it Henry, Henry Ford made the working week? Did he? I could be yeah, he, yeah, the working week, he made it five days, right? Yeah. What so, a cunt. He was like the first one to do it in his factories. And it just was that. What, so before him, it was just, oh, I can't be asked going and working today. So. Well, I, I don't think it was quite as much freedom as that, but 
I just don't think it was five days. I think it was like a <laughs> I'm whole week. Slate was back before then. <laughs> yeah. Ah, it might have been. Well, you know a lot about that. Six days you? working for Sunday. Sunday. <laughs> uh, Christian, <laughs> fucking age of him. A lot with a lot of it was yeah, but like in like modern times, he was the one that said it should be five days. Mm. That was some selfish go. bastard. Mm. Well, that answered that. Yeah, there you go. You would have thought we had an answer to your question. I know, yeah, that's actually yeah. mad. I, I, I asked quite an intellectual question and you answered it truthfully and mm. honestly and actually... He bullshitted all of it. Read yeah. Off, read he, off Google. Was... <laughs> I've got Google up here. Well, actually, he did Google. Yeah, he was on his phone. <laughs> I did Google the Roman Empire. Because <laughs> yeah, no one knew not, about that. Not the Henry Ford thing, though. Mm. You brought that up, though. My genius. No. Uh, Henry Ford was like really good friends with Hitler, too. Oh, Ooh, oh yeah. Was he? Mm. That's a shame. Full circle. Who's got mm. a Ford here? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Yikes. Um, Stephen's a Nazi supporter. It's confirmed. It's He's one of the cool ones. Stephen. <laughs> 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 cool ones. Is Stephen a Nazi question mark? <laughs> Probably. <laughs> right, okay. Well, that was good. Good bit of news. Good bit of uh, Nice, nice bit of cheers for that. You're welcome, mate. Um, okay, make sure you're following us on uh, on socials. You know, follow us on Twitter, Instagram, TikTok with the handle Watch Milkmen, so you get behind the scenes and uh, extra content. And also because, hang on, <laughs> let me start again. Also because I show my nippy nipplers on there. So once again, that's, <laughs> that's so weird. I, there's no writing on this <laughs> thing. I'm just letting the people know. Okay. Do you know what I mean? Letting them know. Fair enough. Everyone yeah. wants to see a slice of that pepperoni you've got going. They are like Tastes the size the of pepperoni as well. Tastes the same as well. <laughs> <Why>? Tiny. <Yeah. laughs> what is happening? <laughs> okay. We're just talking about the size of his nips, mate. Hmm. What is the average nip? What the does average... that mean? <laughs> <laughs> what is the average? What is the average nip? Like what? size? Yeah, 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 yeah. Shape? Both, all, all the, all the above. That's definitely not this. I know, but some people do, don't mm. they? Why is it round? Why were you just? Why were you? Why were you doing a sphere? <laughs> a, what do you mean? A spherical fucking nip. What are you on about? It's it, not. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> it's a square. No, it's you're circular. Yeah, yeah, he's talking that's about round. Like, he's talking about like a ball. A ball, yeah. you dick. Not, not like a circle. circular. He was doing that. <laughs> yeah, I was just saying they definitely aren't that. Right. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Anyway, do we need to keep going with this? No. Right, no, good. Just wanted to know. Nice. Well, I don't have the answer to that question. You can show me. All right. Proof later. Get your areola out. Yeah. I want it. Areola. That's a big word. Mm. Where'd you learn that? I made it up. Oh. You made it up, but it was the exact same. <laughs> <laughs> That's crazy. I invented it. That's, yeah. That's amazing. Oh, right, okay. This brings us on to curdled conversation. So, this is a conversation between the five of us where we delve into the hypotheticals of the world's most notorious and despicable questions. And we now encourage you, the audience, to send us. So if you have a question, I mean, somebody please send us a question. And sick of doing, you know, we're doing all the heavy lifting. Jono, here. fucking John- ask us something. <laughs> we know <laughs> Jono will. He's watching this right now. Raul, Get typing. we know you're watching. Uh, your mate's from work. No. <laughs> Not that he hasn't. Uh, no. They probably don't like no. him. Um, um, yeah, somebody Chris's send us a mum. question. Uh, no, they don't. They don't want right. me enough. Um, what? 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 <laughs> it's weird, mate. Anyway, I'll tell you the hypothetical question for this week. Yeah. So, you've got thirty days to spend thirty million pounds, and if you do it, you get three hundred million pounds to keep. Uh, what? Oh, so these are the rules. Right. After the thirty days, you're not allowed any assets, no cars, jewelry, houses. You can hire anyone you want. But you got to get value for their services. You can donate five percent to charity and gamble five percent away. But you can't give the money away to any random person. You have to spend it. But you're not allowed to tell anyone why you have to spend this money. What do you do? Oh, fuck me, that's a I lot. I have literally no what? idea what you've just said. I, I read it and I still don't. Understand. <laughs> I didn't understand what you fuck are. Fuck me, it's really not that hard to understand. Do you know how easy it is to spend thirty million dollars in thirty days? Go on. I'll buy a Ferrari 250 GTO. Yeah, but you're not day. allowed. You're not allowed any assets. You're not allowed to spend it. Uh. <laughs> well, you know that's after the yeah. no. days. Oh, fuck, fuck me. What do you spend it on? Right. Let me explain because you're all retards. You're going to invest it. No, because you're not allowed any assets. You cunt. <laughs> so you're not allowed to spend so it. So you're not allowed to spend it on anything. Fucking right. You yeah, have right. You have thirty million pounds to days. spend. 
within 30 days. If you spend it, you get 300 million, but right? You can't yeah. spend it on At the end of the 30 days, wait, wait, wait. I've lost my train. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> exactly. At the end of the 30 days, you are not allowed to own anything like a house. Like you can't own a 27 million pound house. You can't own a 1 million pound car. You have to spend the money on things and stuff that you get rid of. Like, yeah? Well, yeah, the yeah, the car. Yeah. Blow up the car at the end of the 30 days. Give it away. There you go. There's your answer, you fucking retards. Like, oh, right. Jesus Christ. I'd buy a 4850 GTO and give it away. Yeah, but you, you, but you that's can't one of the rules. You can't, the you can't give it away. But I can't spend the money. No, you can. <laughs> I'm going to fucking kill them. I'll drive it into the ocean. There you go. You can do that. Cool. How much is the um, car? 30 million. <laughs> oh, so you're done. <laughs> yeah, I'm done. <laughs> You've got 300 mil. Yeah, I'm done, mate. By the way, there is a clause. If you don't want to do this challenge, you can just take a mil now. So would you rather try and spend the 30? Nah, because I know I'm spending it on suicide. I'd just spend the 30. On what? What would you do? I'd do the same thing as him. <laughs> well, you can't buy the you same car. Yeah, and you, you can't do the same as him because he's already said that. There's only one car. No, there is a couple. Yeah. So we could, to be fair. Yeah, he buy could. a house. Blow it up. Yeah. So you're buying a £30 million house within well, 30 could, days. Yeah, I could buy cars with it. Like, do whatever I want. And at the end of the day, at the last day, fill it with gasoline. Match. Last, last uh, bit of money on the match. <laughs> throw it. And 50 cents. His last 57 pence. <laughs> throw the, throw the matches in. You can't afford it. He's <laughs> like, fuck, card declines. <laughs> <laughs> well, your your two answers were fucking boring. Chris? I would I'm waiting, gamble I'm waiting for his. on a horse that isn't going to win. Just all of it. Fuck it, straight off the horse. <laughs> nah, it wins. Look at the rules. <laughs> look at, look at the rules. Huh? Look at the rules. You can only gamble 5%. Oh, yeah, okay. so you can gamble 5%. What and if I can... gambled 5% every day? Was it? No, it's just oh. 5%. So it's basically... One and a half mil you can gamble. One and a half mil you can give to charity. So you got £27 million to spend within 30 days. Okay, I buy loads so of So like when he said a house, a house isn't going through in 30 days. So he's fucked it. He's lost the, he's, mm. he's lost all the money. I just buy loads. So no assets. Yeah, so you but can't own anything. shit, you know what I mean? Yeah, like, exactly. £30 million. Go take like really shit. fancy places to eat. <laughs> <laughs> you're not Send spending 30 game. mil on that, are you? Yeah, I think you could spend a good amount. Like, mm. you know, there's all these like, gold steaks and things mm. like that. Not 30 mil, though. No, yeah, how many fucking mental. steaks are you eating? Yeah, but. You just have to eat them. Even if the steak itself is. That's like a good two point. Grand. That's a good point. I reckon there's like some like proper like fancy restaurants where it's like hundreds of thousands to eat, even though like, to enter the fucking restaurant. Yeah, like Gordon Ramsay's gaff. I reckon there's got to oh, be something like, like that. Fancy it's hotel just, room. Mm. Five star hotel room. Yeah, yeah, just like have a nice holiday. I've got 30 mil, mate. I mean, even if I don't win, I'm going to enjoy it for like yeah. <laughs> for a month. And then, yeah. So, yes, yeah, so that's what I do. Just like just spend it on stuff. Yeah. <laughs> you would have thought, I've got money and I'm going to spend it. It's crazy. But, yeah, that's what I do. Ellis? Um, mine kind of goes in turn with yours. So what I do is take the milkman on tour for 30 days, we go to a city and we just have a wild night, spend a mil. That's my answer as well. You'd you can't party. have the same answer. We'd weed party. Yeah. You'd get. Fuck you, I can do what I want. <laughs> you get. I'd have a nap. <laughs> you guys are party. <laughs> <laughs> You'd nap on the most expensive bed there is in yeah. that city. I'd go to Liverpool, buy that shitty fucking hotel that we stayed at and demolish it. <laughs> yeah. I'm not sure it's worth 30 mil. No, but it would get it would get rid of at least a hundred grand mm. <laughs> if it's worth that. That was awful, that wasn't it? It was horrible. Oh, <laughs> Literally wait. used needles in the room. I like. know, disgust and no lights. No lights. <laughs> like what? Cold water. <laughs> what? Oh water yeah, yours didn't work. <laughs> what uh, else was wrong with that? Oh yeah, well, our room needles. stank of smoke. fucking smoke. They got the wrong like beds. Were like yeah, beds. beds were fucked up. There was a dildo outside someone's window, wasn't there as well? What? Vibrator, I think. Oh, yeah, vibrator. Yeah. Oh, yeah, there was yeah. outside. Outside, was outside there? his room. Was there? And then there was like a fancy party going on downstairs. Yeah. Not to see what that was dresses. weird. Like, what? Shit nice. out. Uh, don't go. Adelphi, sort your shit out. There we go. We yeah, went... So, what would you do? A night out as well? Yeah, just like. A £30 million pound night out. No, just hang over 30 there. days of nights out. Good mil each. God. Yeah, just go to like really expect like Ibiza. So, yeah. Well expensive. Dead by the, <laughs> yeah, the Pay a mil to get into a club. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. 
is fucking hundred grand for opening the door. Most expensive hotel, most expensive meal you can get. I'd hire some. I'd hire someone because you can hire someone. I'd hire someone to literally just find me the most expensive places to go and. I thought you were going to say like. I mean, like every day we go, you can hire a midget to come with you. Can we do that? Yeah, you <laughs> can. Because why not? Get a wee You're man from it. Um, oh, mate, it was so good. Yeah. Jackass, that's it. Yeah. We actually just every time you get in a fight. <laughs> Where are you getting you the thirty mil? No, not the thirty mil. That's just there's a, a there's a there's a. <laughs> So no, next, there's a midget podcast. who lives next to me quite um, recently, so I can hook him up and uh, let yeah, you know. His number. Mm. You know a midget? He's not really. He's a neighbour. <laughs> <laughs> but is he a midget? Yeah. So you know him? Is he a midget or a dwarf? There's a difference. Is there? Yeah, is there? Educate me. Yeah. Yeah, I'm pretty sure you're not allowed to call them midget. Yeah. <laughs> oh, okay. That's the difference. Yeah, I think it's a little person now. <sighs> That sounds even more well, like isn't, derogatory. Isn't anyone, no, I think it is. That's what, I think that's what they prefer now, a little, little person. Shorty. I think it's 4'11 and under. You're classed as a dwarf. A dwarf, yeah. I don't think it's quite 4'11, though. I think it's like 4'7. No, it's 4'11, I swear. Yeah. yeah. I swear down, mate. Honestly, I, why would I lie to you about relax. this? Relax. Yeah. Fuck. Nice. To calm down. No. I'm very... Into no, it's <laughs> okay, just nice. yeah, right. yeah, it goes. Uh, moving on. Yeah, what's next? Um, <laughs> yes, right. What would you do with a 300 mil? She's going to buy a Ferrari 250, <laughs> blow it up like 10 of them, 100 of them. Yeah, but yeah, but oh, I'd love one of them. I actually had a hypothetical question. Go on. So, I seen I, I'm stealing it from another video that I seen on TikTok, and it was the question was, right, if you race against Usain Bolt. Right, mm. you've got a hundred grand, but it's a hundred meter sprint, so you can have a head start by however many meters, but that's taken off the hundred grand. And if you win, you beat Usain Bolt, you get to keep what's ever left, whatever's left. So mm. how far so say of a head start? If you start at like fifty meters, you get fifty k. Yeah, yeah. Or like if you start at thirty meters, you get seven. You get thirty k. Just start. No, if you get ninety nine, get yeah. k. So what? if you have like a thirty meter head start, Fucking... you'd get seventy. Yeah. Okay, do you know what I mean? So where would you start? I mean, he does it in like what nine, like nine seconds. Something? He does a hundred meters in nine seconds. It's nine, like nine point four seven. I, think. Yeah. Yeah. I, I don't think I can stand up that yeah. quick. That's why I started at the finish line. <laughs> I reckon. I reckon I could be seventy meters up. I don't think you can. <laughs> I could thirty grand. Yeah, I think you could do thirty meters. I think <laughs> you could, but you'd have to tackle him. Or trip <laughs> yeah, him just over. fucking turn around, hit him, and then carry on. <laughs> you the starter pistol, you aim at him. <laughs> Why have you got the pistol? Yeah. Bro, no, tell, give the guy, give the guy some of the money. The guy, yeah, the guy, pay him, yeah. pay him like ten grand to shoot you saying. You saying ball? Yeah. Yeah. What the yeah. fuck? I mean, you've, you've rigged the hypothetical, but yeah, yeah, yeah sure. Um, but realistically, how far? Like, how far is a hundred meters? About hundred meters. Mm. <laughs> yeah, but like, I'm trying to think in my head of. About table. Well, no. Not quite. Well, okay. Um, <laughs> like if you said 50 metres, that's 50 grand you'd get. Like he can he run, isn't it like grand. 30 mile an hour he can run? I think it's just like just under it like 28 or something. Oh, can't be allowed in Wales. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up. Shut up. Oh. Oh, I don't know. Yeah. Like how, could you run 50 metres in under Full stop, no. <laughs> In under ten seconds. Yeah. Well, no. Hang on. So he did, right? Okay. Yeah. Ooh. I think Simon's answer is good. Seventy. Because you get you thirty get grand. That's a fair whack. Yeah. And it's doable. Mm. I think it's doable. Thirty meters. I'll go for forty. Right. Next time you're on treadmill. <sighs> but like. In ten seconds. Thirty you meters in ten how seconds. How fast that is? Do you know what yeah. I mean? Yeah. Uh huh. Until mm. you see it. Like he's. That is so fast. 30 metres in 10 seconds. So you're doing three metres. Oh, we'll just get like you're doing three metres metre metre every second. Yeah, this is what I mean. Like, there's nine <laughs> Fucking hell, yeah. That's actually seconds. ridiculous, isn't it? Isn't that mad? Or you could get like an easy 10k. Just do 10 metres. Have a little walk. Yeah, to the but I want 30k. <laughs> <laughs> Even if I lose. I'm getting 30k. Um, <laughs> I'll get it somewhere. Where's that starting pistol? <laughs> No. Oh yeah, fuck. That's actually an awful question. <laughs> so Stevens won. Pussy. He's getting a grand. One meter again, an easy grand. He's Loses. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he trips over something. You could run three feet in ten seconds. 
<laughs> you're saying you can do 30. Easy. I've only seen you run once. Yeah, it was by accident. <laughs> it was going downhill. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I tripped. <laughs> what, what would you do? I think, I reckon I could do 50. No. 50 no metres. No, you couldn't. 50 metres in 10 seconds. I get seconds. 10 seconds. He's got to do 100 metres. It doesn't matter what he's doing. <laughs> what are you fucking on about? <laughs> he's got, well, he's got so, to do 100 so metres. So you're five seconds extra of him, pretty much. Yeah. Because you're halfway. He can do. So for when, for when he passes your point, he's only got, what, five seconds till he finishes? Yeah. And I'm... So you can do 50 metres in five seconds? No, I'm doing, no, no. I'm doing it in 10. He's got to do it in five. Oh, yeah, you're right. Yeah, but he can do it in five. That's the point. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I reckon I could do it. So you're fi- you're you, five seconds you've lost. Quick, uh, slower than you seem involved. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> I reckon 50 metres in 10 seconds is doable. How many metres per second is that? Five. What are you on about now? I'm just trying to work out the maths. I made mine run 100 metres in 12 seconds in school once. That was pretty crazy. You don't ball? have mates. Is he using ball? It was him. <laughs> <laughs> We're the same age. Yeah. Anyway. <laughs> I'm going to go with... I'm going to play it a little bit safer than Sai. 25. Because that... 25. Come on. 25 metres in 10 seconds. 25 metres is like this room, right? No. No, no it's not, you fucking... Are pillar. you all right? Like this there to that back wall there? No. No. I reckon it is. Remember, 25, 25 metres. 25 metres. 25 metres is three foot six inches. That's how big a one metre is, is three foot six inches. Yeah, I reckon this table is like a metre, right? That, Probably. That's a metre. Yeah. If we lined up all these tables... No. But there's it's two not 25 there. of them... All right, maybe 20. <laughs> Let's go for 15. Yeah, I was going to say, it's more like 15 max. I'm going to line up these tables after this podcast. Just to we don't it. have 25 <laughs> tables. Anyway, I reckon... That's we have chatted about this far too yeah, long. I know, yeah. Anyway, you're possible? losing 50 grand. I'm not losing. I'm just not gaining if I lose. It's not like he's going to take it from me. Mate, it's not your turn. I mean, sure. <laughs> Simon, do you reckon you can do it? No, no, I fuck. But I'm sticking with it. 30 grand. Yeah. Losing it. Ellis? Try 40 metres. For, that's such a random number. In between them. 14. 14. <laughs> oh, 40. Oh, sorry. I thought you said 14. I was like, that was a bit fucking random. <laughs> 1, 25. So I'm the only winner. Cool. Nope. So Oshan's the only uh, second winner. Okay. I'm doing it, mate. <laughs> You're going to train now. now. You're going to prove the point. Run. Yeah, we're, we're all going to... In the car park later. <laughs> yeah. We'll get Usain Bolt now. <laughs> That's how weird that I'd look like people walking past. We're in a dark car park <laughs> running the 25 What the fuck meters. is Usain Bolt doing here? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Right, okay. Yeah, we've talked plenty about this now. So moving on to the, the next segment, which is the change game. So two of the Milton perform a scene based on suggestions from everyone else. At any point during the scene, the host can say, change! At which point, the previous line of dialogue and all action is replaced with a new line of dialogue. And our action. So, who's doing what? Who is who? Well, I hosted last time. Alice and Cy were involved, so one of them host. Okay. Uh, Cy? Yeah, Cy, do you want a host? Yeah. Do you shout change? And then you and Steve? <sighs> Fine. <Isn't that> what <laughs> happened last time with schizophrenia? Yeah. <laughs> I just go straight back to that in the same. <laughs> Part exact two. Same, yeah. So, have schizophrenia. Look. who are you? Who are you? Who are you? Well, you tell me. They're footballers. Footballers. Right. Two people that know nothing about football. Yeah. <laughs> I might make it funnier. <laughs> Discussing the game that's happening this Saturday. <laughs> or they're half time and they're losing. And they're trying to hype themselves up. Okay. Mm. I like it. Start now. <laughs> so what with footballers change <laughs> <laughs> okay um, oh man we're not doing too great <laughs> <laughs> fucking hell <laughs> feel the real emotion yeah <laughs> oh, oh man we're not, not doing great <laughs> <laughs> no, you need to get your act in order I'm, I'm kicking the ball aren't I <laughs> you're offside change <laughs> you're onside <laughs> yeah 
hang on, remind me again. What is the rule about being on side? This is not going to go well. <laughs> Make it <On> up. Side. <laughs> There's no rule of being onside. <laughs> well, you, this is the type of stuff you're talking about. You're making us lose here. <laughs> My bad. My bad. Um, yeah, so how how are we losing again? <laughs> <laughs> this is the worst one. It is, isn't this it? Is the worst one. <laughs> because you. Oh, yeah, I got a bit confused with the goals. Change. <laughs> what did I do? <laughs> <laughs> this is this is possibly the shittest change game we have ever done. What did you expect? <laughs> yeah, no, <it's> <laughs> two <laughs> footballers about football yeah. <laughs> whatsoever. Why don't we change it to something that they do know about? Or why don't you guys improvise from being footballers to something else? Porn stars. <laughs> oh, I I know. See, Chris, we're footballers. Change. <laughs> <laughs> no idea what we are now. <laughs> um, fucking hell. Are we done? No, he's thinking. Change. Uh, what? <laughs> Wait, no, I'm in it. <laughs> right, Simon's in it. Uh, I'm the goalkeeper. <laughs> he just said we're like... not footballers. Oh, <laughs> Keep with it. The He's a Swedish goalkeeper for some reason. <laughs> I'm the goalkeeper. I'm the goalkeeper. I keep the goal. Is this, are we going with this? Yeah, there's a person who changes as well, so this is not going to <laughs> work. We're yes. digging the hole, we're going to keep That's going. That's a good goalkeeper, but you're, you're, you're supposed to be in the midfield. Change. <laughs> <laughs> no, <laughs> fucking hell. <laughs> <laughs> you can't be in it and change. No, <laughs> Stephen's now the change guy. What is going on? I'm so, I'm so lost. <laughs> okay. What? <laughs> yes. Uh, I keep the goal and the middle field. No, very nice. <laughs> Fuck me. Right. No, Move on. Done. Get he's out of done. here. Get out of here. Fuck <laughs> me. Borat, come out. Jesus <laughs> <laughs> very no nice. Was very nice. <laughs> <laughs> he was a normal guy. <laughs> so just bar out, just to show he's on the team. Fucking hell. He walks in the room. Very nice. Fucking <laughs> <laughs> shittest one. Uh, yeah. Okay. Nice one, lads. Yeah, we did good out. there. We did good. Okay. So this brings us on to our final segment. Thank God. Thank God it's the end of this. Um, which is Simon's Milk Facts. Oh, bollocks. Every uh, time. Simon, improv, I know, improv. I know you've got one. I can just feel it. Go ahead. Well, do I have one? <laughs> Let's just mm. discuss that for a second. You yeah, guys <laughs> discuss that for a second. Yeah, so Simon's about to deliver a factual uh, of the milk. Mm. Of, <laughs> a factual of the milk. <laughs> nice. Yes. Did you know... <laughs> milk contains important <coughs> things for bones so like calcium and shit like that it makes your bones well strong yeah That's we already I can do this oh, okay we okay. okay well we already knew that so oh my god there's a fact then yeah, yeah, but it's, it's, a, uh, it's a matter of fact come up with another fact yeah one that's fun um it doesn't say fun fact, it just says... Fucking shut up, you cunt. Did you know dinosaurs <laughs> could, <Drank> milk. <laughs> could milk? They liked milk. <laughs> could they? <laughs> no, I'm just making it up as I go along. Oh, um, the average American consumes 25 gallons of milk a year. Is that it? That is weak, that. Dude, I, that I feel like that's not that much. <laughs> I... I drink so much milk, it's fucked up, yeah. <laughs> He's got a serious problem. He's got a cow in his room. Yeah. <laughs> Permanently milked. If I did, mate. That's called Simon, mate. Homes. Oh, did you hear that? Did you hear that? That is it, mate. I'm going to... Ellis just called fight. Simon a cow. And cry myself to sleep. I do milk myself. <laughs> Shall we end it with that? Yeah. yeah. Bye, everybody. Well, uh, thank you for, for watching and listening to the, the Milk Bar podcast. 
remember to subscribe to our Patreon at patreon.com slash milkmen for early access to our videos, bonus content, monthly toe pictures, merchandise discounts, signed postcards, and, you know, your name in our videos that we produce. And uh, there's more, there's more, there's more. Uh, make sure, if you haven't already, to subscribe to the YouTube channel and uh, click the bell for uh, to be notified for, for the content, yeah? And then um, we'll see you next time. Bye, everybody. Bye-bye. Oh, and I just really want to let everyone know what, that I love Big Willies and I want them all the time because I'm a big m Billy Big Willie. <laughs> Munching Willie Licker. Yes. <laughs>